She's called Tiny Umbrella. So it's Tiny Umbrella logo slowly fading in a boot. Then she's called I Secure OS by GeoSnow, and you have all different versions. So now it has deep scans, has faster scan speed, uh, detects, it detects the mal uh, the main repo malware, bug fixes and stability improvements. So what this tweak does is actually does it searches your device like really quickly. Like for me, it takes like two seconds. I guess depending on how much stuff you have on your device, it could take a little longer or shorter. Also depend on your Wi-Fi or internet connection. And it just basically quickly scans your device and then tells you what tweets that you have that could be dangerous or repos that could be like dangerous and you know what you need to update, what, you, what vulnerabilities you have to your device. If you know someone's connected to your SSH, which is remotely they connected to your device, which could be really really dangerous and harmful to you. It tells you if someone is and tells you you know if it is, then it tells you to change your password. You can easily change your password with this tweak. So security vulnerability wise, this is top best tweak I can honestly say and. It's just it's pretty new, uh, maybe like a week or something, or five days is what we've been out for, and it gets updated constantly. Uh, hopefully, the developer you know stays on this topic. I think he will. I mean, he's a YouTuber as well. Uh, his name is iDevice Central. He's like 130,000 subscribers, and he's pretty passionate about jailbreaking. So I think it's pretty cool to see a YouTuber have a have their own tweak, and it to be it's it's actually a really good tweak. So credit goes to him. She's called Translow. And it's a translate tweet that you can make your life easier when chatting with foreigners. So you can chat in any language you want without, you know, with ease and without having to go back and forth to change translating apps. And this tweet's called Reach Spring and trigger Reach Spring like a god invoking the reachability. Just the card Apple File Conduct 2. And which are on any ARM 64 device for iOS 11, 12, and 13. This is called More Recent Songs, Please. Unlimited number of recently added songs in the music app. It's called Asia Revived, an aesthetic look to your love activity toggles. This is called uh, Badu Maps GPS coordinates and displays location in the Badu Maps for Cyrus uh, 9 through 14. This is called Badu Import Import Vibrate 8. It's an added vibration in Badu Input. It's called Big Bang Ev, with Cyrus 13 to 14. So that's content in your chat, content browser, edit, Big Bang Menu. The bang all words to pieces and take you want to copy. This is Carla Bellis. Make sure to see your homepage useful again. For this live update, jailbreaking Apple News, range from three sources. This is called Libellum and in your face notes. So you basically have like notes on your lock screen. So and maybe your home screen. Yeah, you can have multiple pages of notes. Um, you have to find your lock screen. This is called Weatherground. And tweet that brings weather to your fingertips. So you have these features right here. This is called Dyadic. And I combine the Today page with the Control Center with new gestures. Open new Control Center. This is called GPS Faker GPS or GPS Faker Expert. And allows you to change your location, GPS location for your apps and games. This is called Type Tab. Compare the iOS 8 to 14. Let's do that improves Safari by allowing you to type text into the address bar and less taps. This is called Big Bang Etz. And so then you need to take a portion of the entire paragraph that is not adjacent to a word or phrase. You need to combine today's search or navigation. So, pretty cool. You have all these features right here. This is called Wi Fi QR. Generates a QR code for Wi Fi networks directly from the settings. This is called uh, QQ, QQ purification, clean QQ for you. This is called Swipe the Lock. <clears throat> Come out with iOS 12 to 14. Swipe up uh, to lock your iPhone at 11 or 12 for iOS 12 to 14. Called Status File 2, updated and hopefully bug free version of Status File 2. So, pretty cool. She's called Status Vise and Visualizer and Status Bar. Next tree is called Quick ANC, surprise the way you switch between transparency and noise canceling mode. So, this is called Big Sur Center. Big Sur Center replaces the default iOS Control Center. It's a new modern and lightweight control center inspired by macOS Big Sur. Available now on the Twift repo. The last tweak is called VNode Bypass. And it's an experimental tool to hide Jeremy files for bypass detection, really similar to current bypass. So if like Pokemon Go, this tweak will allow you to bypass and play Pokemon Go on your Jeremy and iOS device. But you guys, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. Like, comment, subscribe.